here's my Norico 7864XL uh, electric shave. Um, after about 10 years, the batteries finally gave up. Um, I don't want to replace the shave because uh, it's a gift from my uh, from my wife. So I decided to uh, replace the battery myself. Just go to uh, eBay and buy a uh, replacement battery. Uh, actually, this is uh, essentially um, double A type of battery, as you can see. However, uh, if you use the regular rechargeable batteries. Um, it is a little bit difficult to uh, saw the tabs onto them, so it's much easier to just buy the uh, um, the already already um, assembled with the uh, uh, tab type of battery. Okay, and uh, um, there are two clips here for the uh, screw for the uh, back panel. Prizes open. Um, and lift them out of the uh, body. As you can see, there are two tabs um, on each the clips here. Uh, that's what holds them uh, in place. Okay, and the front one uh, same. One tab each side. Take that out, and you can actually lift out the uh, circular board. Uh, don't do this uh, too many times because uh, they basically connect to the battery with uh, um, two pieces of uh, connectors and if you bend it too many times it probably will um, break. Anyway, let's uh, take a look at the uh, back side of the uh, PCB. So, those are the uh, two connectors to the uh, um, motor and these two are the connectors to the uh, battery which we are going to uh, put the new one in and as you can see they are bent here so it will be a little bit difficult to solder them off and lift the whole battery assembly out so let's uh, do it a little bit different. Let's try to break the batteries. Try to, I'm trying to uh, pry them out of this uh, plastic mount here. Okay. As you can see, let's try to uh, break the tab with the uh, repeated motion here. Okay. So you probably need to do it uh, about 10 times or so to break these uh, tabs All right. by the way uh, these are nickel cad batteries so make sure when you buy the replacement buy the same type because the charge circuit will be a little bit different from a um, um, nickel MH battery Okay. so anyway now the battery is out, we'll flip this open and try to sort those two uh, tabs off. So before you actually try to sort those two tabs off, remember they are very close to this uh, plastic holder. So you don't want the heat from the uh, solder to uh, actually melt the plastic holder so let's do the same thing uh, bend those remaining of the tabs until they break off I already uh, got one down and this is the second one okay all right with that we'll try to um, take it under the remaining of those tabs. Just lift them off. Get the plastic one and let's do the other one. 
should be pretty simple. Just melt and lift. Of course, now the holes are filled with uh, solder, so let's see if we can restore the. Uh, there are two things you can do. You can melt and you can try to blow it open. Or you can get a um, vacuum pump to suck the... Uh, Thank you. Let's take a closer look. The two holes for the uh, battery leads. And we'll insert the new battery, the leads for the new battery into those uh, two holes. Now we have uh, put the new battery back and the plastic holder is in. There's a tab here. and tab here and also another tab here okay now let's finish the uh, soldering work with a little bit solder as you can see this is a little bit difficult here Open like this, and it's not too hot. Let's do this. Get a little bit more solder and put the tab on just a little bit. Okay, let's take a closer look of the finished soldering, um, the two soldering point. This and this. No need to use too much solder, just make sure everything is secure. Okay, I think that's it. We'll put everything back and start the charging. Um, so if the new tab is too long, you can uh, cut a little bit off from the top so it won't um, rub against the casing here. Put this back and put the two uh, tabs back in, uh, push the two tabs down into place and put your back cover back everything should be good to go actually even we haven't tried the charger see if it works yep and that LED is on, we need to uh, charge it. Okay, so that's it. My uh, first YouTube video. And hopefully this uh, shiva will work well for the next 10 years. Don't have to do it again soon.